Okay, hello and good morning. And thank you so much for taking the time to do this interview with us. My name is Afrika from Innovarum. And here we're going to take the chance to quickly present you from Sedema. So uh, could you please introduce yourselves? Hello, good morning. My name is Gemma Castejon. I'm the General Director of Sedema and Coordinator of Valley Waste Project. Um, my name is uh, Martin Soriano, and I'm also coordinating the Valley Waste together with uh, Gemma. Okay, okay. Thank you so much. So um, we are going to start with some quick questions to understand better what you do and a little bit more about the Valley Waste project. So um, the first question we have is, what has been Sedenma's role in the project so far? Well, uh, Setema is the coordinator of the Valley Waste uh, project and our main role is uh, to ensure that all the tasks are implemented uh, properly and that the budget is used according to the grant agreement um, to ease communication between partners and to act as the intermediary between the European Commission and the parties. As coordinators, our uh, focus is to watch over the scientific, the technological, social and environmental impact of the project and the, the policy relevance of project results. And in addition, uh, in Valley Waste, uh, we are in charge of developing the environmental uh, life cycle assessment and the social life cycle assessment. In the case of environmental LCA, uh, our interest is to evaluate the environmental performance uh, along the life cycle of the Valley Waste processes. And in the case of social life cycle assessment, um, we address the social and sociological aspects of the value waste solution, and um, we um, address uh, the current and potential impacts of um, the processes along the life cycle. Okay. Okay. I see. Okay. So. Um... Okay, so that was your role, and uh, now after after um, more than two years of project development, what has the Tenma planned for the near for the near future for Valley Waste? Yes, um, so we, we are in the most important part of the project. It's all work packages producing uh, results. That's the the focus for the near future from the coordination and management point of view uh, come, comes as as follows. So the first thing is to increase the quantity and the, and the quality and keep the quality of the selectively collected bio waste by seeking new sources and continuing and reinforcing the citizen um, awareness campaign. Uh, improve the fractionation process of bacterial biomass and demonstrate the, the production capacity. Uh, ensure the proper testing and validation of the pilot plant here in, in Murcia and the, safety, and the safety and functionality of the bio waste derived products. We also want to, to gather all the required information from the pilot experiences to elaborate solid recommendations for large scale projects and environmental assessment. Uh, it is also important to ensure that the project produces solid and sound evidence to, co to be considered in the upcoming legislative revisions. Um, improve consumers' acceptance of the new bio waste derived products. Um, last but not least, boost the integration of the technologies in the bio waste solution, developing common business models, commercialization strategies, and uh, symbiosis blueprints for the whole solution. Okay, okay. Okay, an ambitious, an ambitious, an ambitious, ambitious steps for the coming months. So as the grid keeps on growing and developing, what is your ideal outcome for your value waste? Well, our ideal outcome is to demonstrate the first complete solution to fully valorize uh, urban bio wastes into high added value products and ready for replication into the current waste management schemes in cities across uh, Europe and across the world. And for sure, um, to uh, create the adequate market conditions in terms of legislation and citizen acceptance for these uh, new value-based products uh, to be commercialized and to create uh, job opportunities and economic growth. This will be our ideal end of project. 
And the next uh, natural step after value waste will be to create these circular atmospheres in cities that help to unlock investments for these new um, bi urban bioeconomy initiatives to become a reality. And uh, this is what we are addressing now with our new Horizon 2020 project, uh, Hoop. Okay, okay. That's, that's definitely a great ending. Circular atmospheres in cities in Europe. Yeah, definitely sounds, sounds great. So thank you so much. It has been quick, it has been short, but I think it has gone really straight to the point and it has helped me and I hope the viewers understand a little bit more the project. So thank you so much for your help and we will know more about you soon. Okay, thank you, Africa. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.